Michael. Thirty years of studying Desert Marsh to return with great pioneer media studies, the field still does not have its own identity. Symptomatic of this is the need to constantly overturn the pluralism, to recite all these mistakes and bemoan his naive tradition of the end of labor, the emergence of a peaceful global theater, and the development of a new planetary consciousness, a kind of wired world spirit. Counterblast. My writings are an exploration of some ideas, exploration without conclusion. I'm searching for something I may never find. That's not pessimism, by the way. I'm enjoying the search. What allows me is that these university professors are going back to their institutions and giving their students a totally false view of my work. They're telling the young people all about the meaning of my work and nothing about the search. And young people nowadays desperately need to be involved in a search. Ever since I've then read Truman's work as a participant in that search, of course, I don't know what he's looking for, but he didn't seem to know either. Which I think is very healthy. Blast McLuhan's idea of community. Global village to my mind, as Dr. Gregory Whitehead, Lawrence Bowen, global village to my mind, is sort of in the same elusive category as the primal spree. The problem with the whole constellation of ideas having to do with the electronic tribe, radio as a talking drum, the wired society, general net, is that there is no necessary or automatic relationship between communication and technologies and communities. The slogan that communication equals community is only true when people are willing to work very hard to achieve it and are then willing to fight to preserve what they have built. 